Video from an Ohio traffic stop this weekend shows an officer ordering a police dog to attack an unarmed man who was surrendering to the authorities. We want to warn you, you may find this video disturbing. ABC's Rena Roy has the latest on this investigation, new tonight on News 8 at 6.30. Do not release the dog with his hands up. Disturbing body camera video shows the moments an Ohio police officer ordered his dog to attack an unarmed suspect who was already surrendering to authorities with his hands up and on his knees after a highway chase. Say on July 4th, officers tried pulling over 23-year-old driver Jadarius Rose for a missing mud flap on his semi truck. Authorities say Rose refused, instead starting a chase. Several departments joining the pursuit. Police dash cam video shows Rose pulling over when officers order him out of the truck at gunpoint. He takes off again. About seven minutes later, officers slow the truck down using spike strips. Rose exiting the vehicle, hands in the air, complying with commands. K-9 officer Ryan Speakman from the Circleville Police Department approaching with his police dog. Do not release the dog with his hands up. This Ohio Highway Patrolman repeatedly warned Speakman against using the dog. Speakman then appearing to command it to attack. Get the dog off of it! Rose arrested as officers provide first aid. Nobody's trying to hurt you. Yeah. Just let a dog bite me. Later, you hear the Ohio Highway Patrolman talking to fellow officers about his command not to use the canine. Is that not loud enough? Yeah, you said it three, yeah, four like more times. Time. Circleville police are not commenting on the video, only saying the incident is under investigation by the Use of Force Review Board. It's not clear whether the officer's responsibilities have changed at all during the investigation. Rose faces a fourth degree felony for failure to comply. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York. Now, it remained unclear on Sunday why Rose, the driver of the semi-truck, did not immediately pull over when troopers initially ordered him to. He has since been released from the Rose County Jail.